Yeah, hi guys. So I was just looking into um, <clears throat> whether Tears and Antichrist can uh, repent. And um, well, actually, I started off with Tears, but might as well look at Antichrist too. So just to look at stuff, so you got to look at when I, I typed in Tears, right? And the only time Tears is is in Matthew, which sort of took me back a bit. I kind of thought it'd be in Mark as well, but it's not. Um, I'll show you why that is. All right, so if you look along here, you've got the uh, the first seven, or just after the seven, first seven years. You got Luke at the beginning, so Luke is speaking to the bride, um, the the uh, rapture, uh, the escape at the start there. Then you got Mark, and Mark speaks to the tribulation saints. All right, and your great multitude rapture here, and Matthew is uh, mainly to Judah, or well, is to Judah, and. Um, yeah, Judah's in the in the trumpets in the worst part of the um, tribulation. So uh, that, that's what I mean when I'm looking at Matthew. This is the area I'm thinking the time time period. So when I'm thinking tears, I'm thinking that area. But obviously uh, they're still here. So I'll uh, just go back get back to that. So. Yeah, so Matthew, I'm thinking that part of the timeline. So it says here, uh, <clears throat> uh, let both grow together until the harvest. All right, so the harvest, well, oh, there's another bit here. Uh, then Jesus sent the multitude away, right? So that's another word that sort of jumped into my mind. Oh, multitude, all right. And they went into the house, all right? I'm thinking, and Jesus went into the house, all right? And down here, declare unto us the parable of the tares. And, uh, okay, so, yeah, so the, where is it, the multitude, that's the multitude here. So, after the multitude left, it's got here, he said, but say nay, lest while that ye gather up the tares, ye root up also the wheat, right? The wheat is the great multitude, right? So you've got the, um, this is the old wheat here, this is the new wheat, alright? So after the wheat's gone, that's when the tares um, are still around, alright? So he said, nay, lest you gather up the tares, you root up also the wheat, which means there's potential. That which means tares can actually change um, to wheat. All right. So, because um, why say that at all? So tares can actually change their mind and become wheat. Because um, wheat think a certain way. They they don't like tares. I'll give you a, a rundown on tares. Tares have their own. Um, understanding of God, right? They they still because they're pretending to be wheat, right? They sound like wheat. They're all preachy and all that. And um, I've given you pretty much the rundown on the tears. I could probably try and find the folder again. Uh, just of tears. All right, so. Yeah, these are the characteristics of tares. So they pretend, right? They mimic the wheat. Um, you'll know the flavour of them. They're like mean and nasty. Habitually take license. Um, genuine. That they possess an air of moral superiority. All right. So uh, they they want to get on top of you. They're legalist. So they always put themselves under the law, or you under the law. They they they. It's more you they want to put under the law. They possess an improper emphasis. Um, so they'll be... Um, yeah, they're, they're not... They're not interested in... Um, changing the hearts of people through the love of Christ. Uh, there's a fascination with outward change. Alright? Um, God can only give this, right? So that, that's the thing. God, Only God can change you and he's the one who draws you and all that. Uh, in their private life, they're deviates. <laughs> they claim to be sinless, right? They'll never um, admit mistakes. Uh, they're controlling and accusatory, so they'll always speak with the accuser's voice. And, yeah, they'll wear labels. I'm such and such, whatever. 
All right, so that's tear. So, and they're usually like white supremacists or black Hebrew Israelites or something like that, right? So they've got they got something that um, that relates to them, and they're using God to push forward their what they want to believe. All right. Um, that their skin's great and wonderful and only people with their skin can get God and whatever else, you know, that, those sort of things along those lines. So that's Tet. So yes, I, I think they can change. So then you got Antichrist. Um, all right, you heard Antichrist shall come. Um, who is a liar but he that denieth that Jesus is the Christ? He is the Antichrist. And he denies the Father and Son, all right? So... While you're denying uh, Jesus and saying that no, Jesus is not God, uh, Jesus is nothing, or or whatever, there is no God, blah blah blah. Um, and this is that spirit of Antichrist. All right, so they have a spirit in them, whereof ye have heard that it should come, um, and even now already is in the world. Okay, for many deceivers are entered into this world who confess not that Jesus Christ has come in the flesh. Alright, this is a deceiver and an antichrist. Alright, so that's a spirit that's in them. So, in, in seeing things like that, spirits can be removed. So, there's even, I'd say even um, antichrist can change. I don't know how they would want to if God draws them or whatever it is but maybe it's potential but with Antichrist they don't want they, they really don't want God right they, they just not don't really don't want him they'll, they'll fight you every step of the way and there's really just no point in talking with Antichrist at all there really isn't like um there's some that say that Jesus is not God, right? He's just a man in the flesh, which is usually the Hebrew Israelites. So I'll do that too. Um, I, 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 yes, they would be Antichrist. I have to say it. They are Antichrist. All right, because they're not confessing with their mouth that Jesus is the Son of God, which is that's what it means. It means he's God. All right, and they they have to confess it and believe it and know it. So um, if they think Jesus is just a man. Um, no, nah, wrong spirit. All right. Anyway, God bless, guys. I thought it was meant to be short. I hope it was. <laughs> All right. Cheers.